Hello everyone, this is Blake, producer with Donkillus.com. I'm here with Pop. Say hi, Pop. Hey. And we're going to be doing another fight video commentary because it's been a while. It's been a couple of months. So we got a nice quick one for you here. It's about a three and a half minute fight. And away we go. I'm going to click play now. Uh, yeah. yeah, this was for uh, the inter intercontinental belt and uh, international rules, which is uh, leg kicks. Um, and since we're in Phoenix, we had to have headgear on, but it was paper thin. We had eight ounce gloves. <laughs> this was supposed to be a, a seven round fight. You have some cushion from the punches here, so yeah. You know, feel in free fact, to hit a little harder. If you look at my legs, they actually uh, taped maxi pads on my shins because I used to <laughs> kick so hard, they would I bleed through them. Oh no shit! Yeah, uh, they don't want me slinging blood out into the uh, into the crowd. Now That's watch this guy. Shinning. This guy kicks so hard too. Uh, who is this guy? Do you remember his name or? No, I, you know, I don't remember hardly any of their names. They all hit you in the head too many times. Nah, I mean, I don't know. I guess maybe that is true. <laughs> Look how hard that guy kicks Oof. the leg. And he's going right for your legs too yeah. every time. Ooh. Yeah, he kicks hard. And then that's the thing too with like the way that you block kicks and stuff, try to step into him like that, he can hit the back of your knee and take you out. Yeah. If you catch it just wrong. But, I mean, he kicked well. He, he didn't punch for nothing. I walked right through his punches. Ooh. Yeah, he was kicking th right through my leg on that one. He almost took me down. Yeah, as a guy like that, I mean, your fighting style kind of... Ooh! That, that was, was a it. good gut punch right there. I, I mean, I fought in this... Uh, <laughs> he was done. I, yeah. I took his wind and I knocked him out. That was it? That was it. That was the fight? That was the fight. No shit. He was finished. Yeah, man, I've actually, I've been there because I was, uh, I was in karate for like 12 years and my instructor, you know, he, I was like the only person his height in my class because everybody else was usually younger than me. There were a few people who were older, but I was about the only one who was kind of his lanky build and everything. So he loved to spar with me. And one time he, he caught me kind of keeping my guard a little too open. And he just nailed me right in the solar plex. I was done. Because you, you hit right there, your diaphragm starts to spasm. You can't breathe for shit. Yeah, it took the wind out of him. That's exactly where you hit him, just like right up under there. It must have felt like you got the Heimlich maneuver. No, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I caught him in the liver, and then I came up to with an uppercut. Oof. But yeah, he kicked hard. My legs hurt for two weeks Oof. after that. Even with your, uh, your slot C pads? Yeah, that, that, <laughs> does, that's just, that was protecting the crowd from my blood slinging into the, into the crowd. It wasn't for my protection. Yeah. So, you don't yeah. need to be slinging blood like an old bird feeder. Just seed. <laughs> Where was this at? It looks like it was in just a normal hall or a high school. Even yeah, it, with those it was. Banners. It was kickboxing actually, and there were smaller venues. And uh, that, that's why kickboxing isn't that big today here in the Western world. It's it's not really built that much. So. Yeah, so MMA is pretty much uh, that's, yeah. taken over as far as that goes. Yeah, when 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 getting punched in the face just isn't enough, you go to kickboxing. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, after, you know, you spent years already being shot at and shit like that, so... Yeah, this is in between wars, too, so I was bored. I just kind of... So this was after Panama, but before... Yeah. Iraq? Okay. This was in 1997. Oh, the same year Titanic came out. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> All right. Anyway, we're going to show the uh, the knockout again, a little slow motion recap there, and... Yep. I think pretty much... Uh, That's it. Just and trying the, to bridge the gap. I, I remember gotta, this guy that I fought, he was like... Was, 18 wins, five losses. So he was really good. Nice. But I just got I just got lucky that day, to be honest with you. Some luck's better than no luck. <laughs> and uh, if you're wondering why we're putting out these little short videos like this, a we got the footage to spend, and b probably by the time this one comes out, I'm gonna have a kid. <laughs> I'm in baby jail for 18 years. So. 18 years. Oh, she's got me for 18 years. So. But yeah, I'm going to be half asleep trying to put these things together for you every week. So I hope you enjoyed it. We got uh, three or four more fight videos that we're going to do commentaries on here and there. They'll be coming at you on redonkulous.com. You have a good night. All right. $114,162.
and 16 cents per hit on the pussy. You're signing over a deed to a house every time you want a poker chick. This is per hit on the pussy. Is it worth a house every time? <laughs> I think not. This is like a one year package for the hottest chick on the Bunny Ranch in Vegas. I mean, literally, you could get the simulated wife package and pay less than this. Not that I would know or anything. 